Hey, what's up guys, I'm Fred Hammond, and today we're going to talk over something, another Herobrine sighting that happened to me. This Herobrine sighting happened about, um, uh, I don't know, about a week after the first one. So, yeah, it's kind of like, um, I don't know, like, more survival-like. Because the last one I just, I was just kind of, like, I just got in the world. This one I actually have a house, and I went mining a couple times. And yeah, so, um, so far nothing weird has happened, as you guys can probably tell, but yeah, something does, uh, something weird happens here soon. So, without edits, like, without me, um, fast-forwarding some of the, some of the video, this video right now is 12 minutes and 19 seconds long. Of course, I need to add some pictures of where we see Hero Run, because I think we see him twice in this episode. Uh, last episode, we only saw him once. Um, but yeah, so, I'm going to do a mine. Uh, yeah, I I'm not actually in my skin, I don't know why. It was just closing out, I guess, or something. Anyway, oh, I'm sick, sorry about that. Um, so I go into the cave, and, you know, it's just a normal cave. Um, now remember, if anybody's asking... Why were you recording this man when you didn't even know you were going to run into him? In the last episode, I said that I'm always going to record in this world no matter what. So this is like recording from that. And um, that's why my I don't actually record my voice. Because if whenever I was in this world, I always recorded my voice, then that would literally be like... I would just be talking here, just like sitting and doing nothing, and it might not even get uploaded if I don't see him or anything. So, yeah. So one thing I forgot to mention is, um, so after the last video, and before this video of the Herobrine sighting, I guess, world, um, nothing's happened. I've just, it's just been a normal thing. I did, as you guys saw, I, I had a, I built a Herobrine spawner inside of my house, so I mean, I don't know. I thought, like, that would help him come and attack me, because now I actually want him to. But yeah, so my pickaxe is broke, which, you know, that's fun. Um, yeah. So we're going back to the house, and look what happens right here. We actually, when we get back home, it actually, um, something weird happens. So when we left, nothing, nothing bad ha was happening, everything was good. And then when we get back, look what happens. So it'll come up in a short bit. Yeah, if you guys are wondering where my house is, it's actually on the trail of where Herobrine led me to his cave last video. Boom, look, my house is, like, burning. I don't even know how it happened, but it's burning. So I get water buckets, and I go over to help it. And I guess that water bucket didn't even work. Yeah, so my house started burning, which, that's fun. Uh, yeah. And that was pretty, you know, un like, unusual, so... But by this moment, I was checking, like, for sure, I'm recording, right? Like, I didn't want to lose this. But I was recording, I was recording, so that works, that works. And we're just putting out the fire, because, you know, I don't want my house... And so I thought that this started the fire, which I'm still pretty sure it did, or here where I just came in and was like, bro, look at this wooden house, it, it needs something else. But anyway, so I, like, let I turned the, the here where spawner fire off. So, yeah, I think I turned it actually back on. No, I don't. I just put the resin torch back. Anyway, um, we, we do what we came here for once we put the rest of the fire out, which was make a pickaxe. Okay. Yes, can I just get, like, the iron and the wood? Please, thank you. So there we go. Now we're making this pickaxe thing. Okay. And I see that the fire is still happening somehow. Even though I put it all out. Annoying. Respawning flower. Fire getting good. Mojang getting good. Anyway, so yeah, once once we're done with that, um, which was pretty annoying. Um, we come over here, and, yeah, we go back into the cave. So, 
I'll just move this down here. Okay. So yeah, we're going back into the cave to mine some more, and um, nothing weird happens. It's still a normal um day, besides my house catching on fire. But I'm pretty sure that was just from the here we're in spawner, so so far it's been pretty normal. Until what happens next. Uh, I'll just tell you what, I'll just show you what happens. So let's just wait for that. Because right now, for some reason, I, I don't really know why I did this. I think it was just kind of like to claim territory. I built a bridge over, and I never went past it. I never went across the bridge, actually. I just left it there. But you know that, whatever, whatever, no, nobody cares, nobody cares. Okay. Okay. So now, let's go, yeah, okay, so this is where it gets pretty weird. So I go to mine this iron, and I'm mining the iron, I'm mining the iron, mining the iron, and then, boom, I turn around, and look, there, I just see a ripped torch there. So, like, I'm kind of creeped out, like, this hasn't happened in a couple, like, a couple days, so, um, okay, so, like, this hasn't happened in, like, a week, so, um, I'm kind of, like, spooked, and, uh, it leads me up here, and there's no more redstone torches, I thought, so, I was very confused, until I, like, turned this, and I saw that there's a light source over here, and it was a redstone torch. Anyway, so after that, I come over here, and the redstone torches lead me to a dead end, which I was, I thought was pretty odd, I thought maybe it was like, wait, what, am I supposed to, like, mine around and look for it, like, hide and seek or something? I didn't find anything for a couple blocks, so I just, like, stopped looking. And I saw that they, that, like, he built this, this, uh, gravel wall behind me, but, like, there was an opening in the wall, so, I mean, I, I don't know. But he built that, like, really fast. Or something, I don't know. Uh, one thing I actually just realized. I don't know if you guys ever see my menu screen on, in this one. Uh, so, yeah, you, you don't know if it's, like, open to land or anything. I actually just realized that. I don't know if I ever showed it. Oh dang. Okay, well then. Now, now nobody believes me, great. Well, maybe I do. Maybe it's just. Maybe I just don't, don't remember. Anyway. I really hope I do. So, there's this creeper here, and. At first, I thought this was a normal. I still kind of do. I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure these those were just like normally spawned. But I see another creeper, which odds of that happening like without seeing it, another mob is are like pretty not so slim. So I'm pretty sure that they just spawn naturally. But hey, you never know. You never know. Anyway, so we get this iron and we go up here. Now this is where something else weird happens. So. I don't know why I just got frame lag. I don't know if you guys saw that, but I just got like some frame lag. Anyway, um, let's look up at this thing. No, no, not, not yet, not yet. When we get to the end of this wall, I start to I start to like dig out because like it's a dead end. Just see if there's any other caves nearby, which there were not. And then when I turn around, there's like red redstone torches. It's so weird. It's so weird. Watch. So I turn around. I go down this cave. And then, boom, there's like a light source. And at first I thought it was like lava or something that I, I like missed the first time. And no, it's a redstone torch. And these were literally not here five seconds ago, so I'm like really scared. Anyway, come up here. And it's a, another dead end. I don't know why here where it just looks to lead me to dead ends today. But you know, he does apparently. Anyway, um... When I turn around, there's here, but I'm just, like, staring at me. No, I'm just, just kidding, um. No, but I come over here, and I get shot with lightning. And then I turn around, and boom, we just saw here, Brian. I don't know if you guys saw it. And then he, like, shocks us with lightning again. At this point, I'm freaking out. Because I actually, when I was first recording this, I actually, um. I did not see here, Brian. Uh, but we did see here, Brian. I'm gonna put a picture up at the beginning of the video because I know if I do it now people will think I like cut the video and they 
yeah, they'll think it's fake. Anyway, yeah, so we actually just saw here, mind you guys can like go watch and rewatch the little clip. Like when we turn around, you just see him, uh, some of his hair and I think some of his face over uh, the like the stairs made out of stone. Anyway, we go back up here and this is like, like, oh shoot, man. That was scary. Like, lightning just stro strike to me. Stroke strike, I don't know. Anyway, uh, we come back here and pick up from Rod Flash because that's my favorite snack on the weekends. Anyway, we come up to our house and it's burning again. No. But we go inside of our house and then something weird happens next. Uh, next, actually, we see uh, that when we turn around, we see here Ryan in the trees. Uh, but, like, um, first we, like, put our stuff away that we got from the mining trip. We put all that stuff away. And then when we turn around and go over to the the forest behind my house, or in front of my house, uh, we see that here Ryan's standing over there. And when I was first watching this, uh, when I was first, like, playing the game, I did not see him. Although I'm kind of confused how I didn't, because he was, like, pretty easy to see. I guess I just wasn't paying attention that, or I just thought I was a zombie or something. Anyway, I decided to relight this and watch it, <laughs> and, uh, be more careful in case, like, uh, you know, it catches my house on fire again. But, uh, anyway, um, we put the phone seal back right there. And then look what happens when we turn around. It's super creepy. It is super creepy. Look. Boom. Our entire house is just gone. What? How? Where? What? I don't... I don't even know. I literally don't even know. I literally, literally don't even know. And then our, our, like, our bridge to our... To the outside world is also gone. I don't even know. It just, like... It just all broke down. Anyway... Yeah, everything's just broken. Anyway, when we go back to the trees and behind me where I am right now, 